Thanks for joining us. I'm Matt Walton with Keek News, putting the whole world in your pocket 36 seconds at a time. Citizens of Spain had a most creative response to their government's new law that imposes huge fines on unauthorized demonstrations. Unable to protest in person, Spanish activists used webcams and special software to create holographic images of themselves. The result was a ghostly parade of 18,000 protesters outside the parliament building, turning the act of a peaceful protest into a work of art. In her short time on Earth, Nobel Peace Prize recipient Malala Yousafzai is a global icon at just the age of 17 for her mission to promote women's rights. But now her star will be shining brightly in the cosmos as well, circling the sun between Mars and Jupiter every five and a half years to be exact. Malala now holds the proud and rare distinction, especially for a woman, of having an asteroid named after her. Bacon is good for you. In a stunning nutritional comeback, everyone's favorite breakfast meat is back on the menu. The Republic of Chile has legalized same-sex unions. It's a sudden and significant cultural shift for Chile, which did not decriminalize homosexual acts until 1999. While our economy still drags, the U.S. spent half a trillion dollars in 2014 fighting their war on drugs. On the bright side, research shows marijuana to be 114 times less deadly than alcohol statistically as safe as driving sober, and not just good medicine, but good business. Together, Clean the World and Global Soap collect and recycle unused hotel soap, and has so far delivered over 25 million bars to 99 developing countries where poor hygiene and sanitation can be deadly. And the latest study of the effects on kids playing video games supports the golden rule of all things in moderation. Researchers have determined that one hour or less of video game play per day has no negative effect on children's behavior and may actually make kids less aggressive. Alternatively, kids who played for over three hours each day were slightly more likely to be hyperactive, get into fights, and struggle academically. Now it's time to announce the Keek News CEO of the Year. This year, Dan Price is our winner. He's the founder of Gravity Payments in Seattle, Washington, a credit card payment processing firm that announced recently that within three years, 80% of the company's profits will be rededicated to his employees, earning them all, even the lowest paid clerk and customer service rep, a $70,000 a year salary. This includes a reduction of his own $1 million salary to the same amount. The latest iPhone software includes an update in diversity with over 300 new emoji icons on a revamped keyboard and features broader gender combinations of parents and siblings and a new generic default flesh tone in a Homer Simpson or Legoland yellow. Users will also have the option of modifying the skin colors with five different tones used by dermatologists. Where do we come from? And are we alone in the universe? This great debate of religion, philosophy, and all mankind may soon have some answers. And they're all on the bright side. Hurling through the